got the professionals out here today doing some detail work. Kind of like Peterbilt days there, Roger. Hotties Mobile Detailing. Gave us a wash this morning and then came back doing a wax. I think it's probably the first time this thing's ever been washed or waxed. Because dealer never cleans it up. It just got shipped down here from the plant and it was nasty. And so they're getting it cleaned up. Looking good. Okay, they got her all done. Cleaned up, shine like a new penny. I think it's probably, seriously, I think it's its first wash. I tell you, the dealer did not wash it. They gave it to us nasty. So, finally paid to get her washed and waxed. That should hold us. Uh, until we head back out in this fall. Looks pretty good, doesn't it? You put the back, the front deck back down now. Now I need to do that nasty truck. Watch that nasty truck. There we go, boys. Now let's get back to work. Good morning. I'm sitting here doing some data entry. We have moved, today is February 14th, so happy Valentine's Day, everybody. We have moved to uh, Peace River, Wallahoola, Florida. Show you our view this time. Some people didn't like our um, thousand trails in Orlando view. So here's what we got today. Got the ports all set up. Nice big front yard. We'll probably have someone come into the site today. Those two sites here have bags. <clears throat> She'll show you what we're working with here. So I was a little bit worried about this Peace River journey because you hear a lot of negativity because half the park is not sewer, but we do quite well without the sewer. They do a free honey wagon pump out. Uh, once a week, we have 100 gallon, I think it's actually 97 gallon gray, two of those, and 100 gallons total black. So we do quite well uh, with no syrup. So we're, we are happy right here where we are. But uh, everything's clean, the rig is clean, the tow pig is clean, and uh, so when we Need to walk the puppy. We can just step right out the back door right here. And what's a good girl? Everybody say hello, Ginger. So we just step out right out the back door. This trail goes to a really awesome trail system. Fantastic trail system. I'll show you after a while. And we discovered orange trees just growing out here in the middle of nowhere. Picked a couple of oranges yesterday. Uh, oh, look at Bloom. The neighbors, a couple of spots down, had a big Super Bowl party last night. Uh, this is what's on the back, non-door side of our unit. So we are pretty fortunate here at the front yard. Uh, anyway, awesome spot. Uh, we gotta get back to work. Just thought I'd show you a view of our new campsite we are here for two weeks uh we move every two weeks so this thousand trails membership is working out phenomenal love it can't beat it so there you go guys let's get back to in, get back into the office get to work got a zoom call here at noon to handle and uh after that we'll take you on the trail and show you the really awesome trail system okay as promised I'm going to show you our trail system right here behind the camp. Now, there are campsites that butt up right to the river. But we chose this site right here just for ease and convenience of the dog. Uh, the river, it just drops right off. And it's not much of a backyard. We did look at all the sites, and we decided we liked this right here better for the dog. Can we just come right out of the back door? And voila, look at here. This Rode bikes on it yesterday and walked the whole thing. It's a couple miles. Uh, 
other direction. The orange goes that way. And of course the river is back here. Let's go show you the uh, river, which we will be paddle boarding in. Hopefully later this week, it's gonna be an 80 Thursday. It's gonna be like 85 or 86 degrees Thursday. Should do some paddle boarding. All right, so here we are just maybe a couple hundred yards and we're at the river. This is Peace River. A lot of people, um, not man, mine, what's the word? They're panning for shark's teeth. Apparently there's a lot of shark's teeth in this river. And I think people come out here panning. That's probably what that guy or girl or whatever it is down there is doing. Panning for shark's teeth. So apparently there's a lot of shark's teeth in this river. And I think there's, I've watched YouTube videos. And I think there have been three or four gators spotted so far i have not seen a gator but uh, we'll look for them when we go paddle boarding but anyway cool spot and there's the uh, campers that back up to the uh river this spot right here was actually open a while ago and we could have got it but uh, as you can see i like my woods better because you get a lot of people a lot of foot traffic through here on this uh trail system so, uh, but yeah, it's a really nice campground so far. I'm loving it. Anyway, you get the drift. Very nice, peaceful walk. Probably how I got the name Peace River. Really awesome sight. I would take you to show you the orange orange grove, a little picnic table there. They call it orange orange picnicking or something. It's about three quarters of a mile that way. And we know you don't want to walk that far. So hope you guys enjoyed the uh, short, small glimpse of Peace River Campground. A thousand trails in Wallahoola, Florida. We are enjoying our stay. You guys have a good day. Thanks for watching. We'll catch you on the next Idiotic Rambling episode. <music>